Hello, the Gospel for January 17 is about the man with the withered hand in Mark chapter 3 verses 1 to 6. Again, he entered the synagogue. There was a man there who had a withered hand. They watched him closely to see if he would cure him on the Sabbath so that they might accuse him. He said to the man with the withered hand, Come up here before us. Then he said to them, Is it lawful to do good on the Sabbath rather than to do evil, to save life rather than to destroy it? But they remained silent. Looking around at them with anger and grief at their hardness of heart, he said to the man, Stretch out your hand. He said, Say, so stretch it out, and his hand was restored. The Pharisees went out and immediately took counsel with the Herodians against him to put him to death. So that was the gospel for January 17. And what's really striking about this gospel is that Jesus was doing a good thing. He was healing the man's withered hand. But instead, people still hate him for it. Maybe they are jealous, angry, and they even wanted to put Jesus to death because of simply doing a good thing on the Sabbath. But looking at how Jesus replies, He said, Is it lawful to do good on the Sabbath rather than to do evil, to save life rather than to destroy it? So it was pretty similar to the lesson before, yesterday, for January 16, that goals are important, but what's more important is the goal. And the goal of Jesus here was to heal the man's hand, which is actually something good. So even if we are instructed not to do anything in the Sabbath day and just rest, we should think about which is more important. And here, Jesus is able to give a good example of how you can choose goodness, how you can sometimes forget your rules to pursue something much greater. And that is love, which is what, is what Jesus did. He had love and compassion for the man. He wanted to heal the man. He could have chosen not to heal that person, but, but he had love and he really wanted to do good. So that is my reflection for this gospel. Do not hesitate to do something good. Live out your faith and God bless.